Hi. Hey, this is Mr. George, Super Magnet Man again. I'll bet by now you think that being Super Magnet Man is just all work and no play. Well, that's mostly true, but not, a lot, not all the time. I've got one thing that I'd like to share with you that's kind of fun that we do. At our church, we've had, every couple of years, we've had a kind of uh, fall festival that we do and activities for the kids. And my class is a bunch of uh, senior adult men, and we all come up with an idea. And I don't know where they got the idea from, but we, we came up with the idea of a magnet toss. And a magnet toss works like this. I contacted a company that's a roofing company, and they had some sheet metal. And I got a piece of sheet metal that was two foot by four foot. I got my wife to make, she's got a banner printer, and so I got her to make me these big banners of pumpkins, and we tape those onto the sheet metal. So the sheet metal's behind here, and then I got some of my black epoxy, eight millimeter magnet spheres. The black epoxy just shows up really well, and we made a magnet toss. Now you see these little ring magnets hanging in the air. Well, we can't just have something as easy as throwing the magnets at the, at the steel plate here. What we wanted was to make it a little bit more interesting. So for the older kids, the fourth, fifth, sixth grade boys and so forth and girls, we hung a few magnets along the, along the way. And when these magnets, as you can see, when they get near this, many times it doesn't actually stick to it, but it deflects it. It makes it look like a real curve ball when the ball comes by and sort of whee, curves off target, makes it a little bit more of a challenge. I'll give you an exact idea about how this works. As you can see, when a ring magnet starts moving, that means that it has deflected the ball. Since it's hanging in space, whenever a magnet gets near it, it's going to either catch it or deflect it. And once it starts swinging a little bit, you know that it is deflecting a lot of them. There's another good one. Curve ball on that one. That was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good curve. Another one got me. All right. Now then, that sort of gives you an idea. If you're looking for a really cool fall festival project, this is hard to beat. Just a few ring magnets and a few sphere magnets with a piece of sheet metal and a poster, you're in business. We had six of these set up. We had six lines that stayed five or ten people deep. We went through, I think it was somewhere, they estimated somewhere between 800 and 900 uh, kids came through our area in just a little over an hour. We ran out of everything we had that we had as little give out gifts for them. It was an amazing event. So if you're looking for that killer activity, yes, you can have fun with magnets. Thank you.